what up YouTube I'm back with another car review and this week we're gonna be reviewing this Lexus this Lexus is so retarded yes we back with another Lexus I'm standing by the road so just don't mind the cars but yes this Lexus is so retarded are y'all ready for it hey, right. Boom. Lexus RC 350 retarded with the big the big gorilla mouth check out the grill on it just look like it's eating up the road dumb ruby red paint job on it i'm gonna take y'all around the side of it this is the f sport edition you see me right there with the logo on it yeah stupid lexus check it out all the way ruby red with the look with the little cuts in it you feel boom back of the car you got the f sport logo you got your little you know your little sensors back here for when you're backing up and it has a backup camera check out the pipes down there it's really nasty boom RC350 tag on it. Made it official just now. Just that time I made it official. Check me out with the red. The red paint job is so wet and glassy, man. We gotta get inside this thing. Just look at it. This vicious. This vicious. Check out the check out the eyelids on it. Retarded. All the way retarded. Let's get in this thing. So first of all, I mean I ain't must see that. Boom. It's got the windows go down when you open the door up for better sound quality inside the car. So now we're going to get inside it and get into these badges. Check inside. We got the Lexus right here on the door. Then you got your door controls as usual. You got your seat settings. And down here, you got your RC on the rug. Then down here, you got your racing pedals down there. And then you got these controls up here about your dimming and stuff like that with your uh, dash and all of that. You can get all the way inside of here. It's very sporty, you know, big bolstered seats and stuff like that for the handle speed. We got the speakers now and then, though. Like I said before in the last video, Lexus have great audio quality in a lot of their cars. So then you got your, your, your dash cluster right here and stuff like that. Move that out the way. <clears throat> Put that back when I finish. Then down here, this is how you control stuff. Boom, you got all kind of different uh, sports mode. And you got your normal mode, your eco mode, just in case you're trying to save gas and make the world a better place at the same time. You got your seat settings and stuff like that for your seat fan, your seat uh, heat warmer. Then you got your shift right here. This is your, infot your infotainment control right here. Boom, it's like, a little, it's like a little mouse. You just touch that thing, move it around and stuff like that. Then... Then you got all your controls on your steering wheel and stuff like that. You got your shift. You got your paddle shifters back there. So to make sure that you're getting, you know, all of your speed training in. You're going speed racing in this. You got the cruise control, like, down there at the bottom of this. You got this nice Lexus timepiece analog clock up in here. That's just something that's classic right there. You don't even much see a whole lot of cars with that no more. Then you got your back seat and stuff like that. And cup holders and stuff like that for the back seat well well your tray for the back seat and you got fans for the back seat and stuff like that but it's really not a back seat car oh uh, hold up let me show y'all this right here you got your sos safety connect on the top and you got your your up for your for your sunroof just in case you want to just tilt it up and get that nice tilt look and then you got the whole the whole opening you know the hole open hold up hold up hold up you got the hole open right there just in case you want to just feel a breeze you could do it in a way you want to we got the push to start on this thing of course legendary push to start with the start button once you get in here you ready for the start it up and drive you got to hit the brake before you can start it up as soon as you hit the brake it hits you with the message on what to do for the start it up so then you just hold this button down it transforms you get your your, your dash cluster comes on your message comes off from Lexus right here in your in your screen in the middle of your console. This illuminates a little bit, gives you your your directions and your caution and all of that about driving with the screen on. And then, hold up, continue. It's gonna just go by itself, really. Boom, and then it let you know where you at. The little map pop up so you don't get lost in your travels and stuff like that. It tells you all kind of neat things in the dash cluster, like how hot it is or how cold it is outside and all of that so without no more talking we're gonna go ahead and get this thing on the road and see what it do all right we in this thing about to take lift off let me just check and make sure ain't nothing coming got my seat belt on everything all nice turn it out ooh, ooh. all right and we on the road 
first thoughts about it. This this acceleration is very nice. It it responds to everything that your foot does. Believe that. Believe it. And when you driving, the steering wheel is just so responsive. It's very sport like. You know what I'm saying? It's very very drifty. Well, not drifty, but fast and the fury ish is if that makes sense somebody gonna make it make sense to them so with that being said it's just a smooth ride like i'm already up to 63 and i just been talking to y'all a little bit and touching the gas just a little bit so it's definitely a car you gotta watch your speed in because it really don't feel like i'm going 65 see i drive a honda accord so my effort to get to 65 is a little bit more challenging than it is for this car this car i just got the and i didn't even much realize it i still can't believe that i'm at well 63 now and i'm in the corner and it's just taking it it's just eating it, it we, we gliding right now i feel like i'm on butter you feel what i'm saying it's just it's just such a magnificent ride i can't i don't know definitely this is definitely like the top car on this page right now this is definitely the top car on this page when it comes to when it comes to driving we're gonna see like what this little what this little get up do hold up let me see let me get up over this hill make sure ain't no people over here no police and nothing like that we're gonna just give it a little just a little something whoa whoa hold up the dumb way the dumb way yeah it let me know what it's about it let me know what it's about and I, it ain't just talking that it's about that yeah got up to 80 that fast no 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 hesitation is getting there it's getting there you say go it's gone you say jump it say high high straight up let me get this thing back to the crib though i'ma holler yeah it's definitely definitely a nice whip i'm just sitting here feeling so sporty i feel athletic in this car like, cause the car is just so athletic. You just make you feel like you, you just on top of the world. You know what I'm saying? Nice little acceleration. Get up out that corner. Whoa, hold up. Hold up. Yeah. This thing do its business. It do its job. It say F sport. And it mean that when they say that, you feel me? Yeah. This thing get off. And we back at the spot. Got the Lexus back, it's so platinum. Even though it's ruby red, it's so platinum. I'm knowing that people gonna be mad if I don't show the, show the engine on this because it's just such a beautiful car. So I'm gonna go ahead and get up in this thing, show y'all what this, this engine look like. Oh look, let me find that thing. There you go. Yeah, got it. I got it. Got... Ooh, look at that Lexus thing. Nasty. It's too nasty. But yeah, if you like this video, drop a like, you know, drop a comment, subscribe, and I'm going to get y'all on the next one. I'm gone.